quicker. Uh, by the way, if you go into the app, you can actually adjust the sensitivity of this with the setting there. The slider at the side of the gimbal handle allows you to zoom in and out. Personally, I almost never use zoom as my device only has digital zoom, which obviously reduces quality. But those of you with optical zoom can probably make better use of this feature. track aim at the object you wish the camera to lock onto click the trigger once to lock onto that object a green box appears around the object alternatively you can draw a finger across the screen to create the box that way now when the camera moves the gimbal will attempt to keep the object in frame or if the gimbal is stationary and the object moves the gimbal moves the camera to follow the object as best it can For any camera to track an object, it needs to understand what it's supposed to track. But of course, tracking can fail if the object becomes unrecognizable to the camera. For example, if the object changes angle or lighting too much during the shot. If the camera is tracking your face and you turn your face away from the camera, it might lose track because what you told it to track is no longer visible to it. In addition, the more clearly defined the object is from the background,